What's going on family? You guys are so amazing. Let me ask you a critical question. Are you tired of your flyers looking like this? And really want your flyers to really look like this? I'm gonna show you how in this video to cut out the background of all of your photos. Let's go. family you guys are so amazing listen on this channel our mission is to empower the world to never give up one video at a time we do how-to videos and we also do motivational videos every single Tuesday we drop a video on this channel to keep you inspired as an entrepreneur business owner or whatever it is that you're doing to keep on moving forward we give you the motivation to keep on pushing this video however is going to teach you how to cut out your backgrounds on your flyers so many people try to make memes so many people try to make flyers and they still got the background on the flyer or the meme and trying to look professional and they really can't and this is the most damaging part about this is the reason I'm creating this video here now is because so many people have questions but they don't know two things they don't know who to ask don't want to ask because you know so many people don't want to share information and it's crazy because here at AOS Inspires we are not in competition with nobody we try to give as much away we try to give as much free information away as we can because I want everybody to win there's a space there's a niche even if you're a motivational speaker even if you're a preacher there's still space for you to grow and to grow your following and to do whatever it is that you want to do in life it's enough space for all of us so in this video and tutorial I'm teaching you how to cut out the background of your photo and this one I want you to do I want you to stay along with this video because at the end we have another video that we you can click on to show you how to do the countdown are y'all ready here we go go to canva.com now I just want to let you know that it is uh, $12.99 a month which is absolutely positively worth it worth your dollars because I use this every single it's not a day that goes by that I do not use canva so I definitely get my $12 dollars worth out of it so here it is you go to canva.com once you go to canva.com you go to create a design since we're just cutting out pictures you just go to uh this desktop wallpaper and what you do is you want to go over here to the left where it says uploads hit uploads and you want to get your image get your image under recent you get the picture that you want to use you find the picture uh that you want to use now for this one i'm going to use Hold on, it's select too many. Uh, I'm going to use a photo that has a dark background just so that you can see uh, the clean cut that it's going to do. Because those that are on Word, you know that when you use Word, it was difficult to get that background off because the black and the black, yeah, as you see, the black shirt, black coat, and the black background uh, with Word, it was difficult for the pro process or the, or the software, rather, uh, to determine what is the background and what is the clothes, what needs to be cut what doesn't need to be cut but this is so much smarter now before I cut it I want to let you know when you get a photo make sure that you have a bubble around you and uh, when I mean a bubble as you see right here uh, my arms on both sides you, you see nothing but arm and space you don't want a photo that's like that right on the side on the right hand side or left hand side depends on how you're looking at the screen uh where my elbow is cut out so when you put it on the flyer you're gonna have to put this picture this side right here all the way to the left of your flyer you don't want to do that you want to have this flyer where it's a I, I like to call it an air bubble all the way around where the each sides you don't have to worry about uh being cut off or anything like that once you cut the picture you will be in the frame and you'll see in a minute and also you don't want to take a picture or you don't want to get a picture taken where it's like that cut off in the head or cut off on the arms like that you don't want that because when you cut the picture it's going to look terrible so you want to make sure that there's an air bubble like i like to call it around the subject or around the picture that you're cutting so the next step is you go to this place uh this click this button right here it says effects e-f-f-e-c-t-s click on that once you click on effects you click on background remover once you click on that background remover guess what's going to happen friends it's going to remove your background look at that now i just want to show you do you see how clean that looks look at that background i mean you don't see no it just it's just a clean cut right and just to show you that it's a clean cut uh, of course we have a white background we had a black background so the black background looks like that but I like to use a different color maybe blue or maybe red it makes it pop a little bit more that way you can see that the cut is really 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 clean look at that 
and it's a really clean cut number one tip and I, I showed you in other videos uh, how to grow your Facebook for how I grew my Facebook from zero to 10,000 the number one thing that you want to do is high quality photos you see how high quality this photo is even if you zoom all the way in it looks really 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 clear and really sharp all right so after you have cut that picture out this is what you do you go to this button on the right where it says download hit the download button now this is the very important part you can only cut your picture out if you have the pro subscription which is $12.99 so that's the only way that you're you're able to have uh, access to this function or this feature now once I hit download I'd hit transparent once I hit transparent, then I hit download. You can do one of two ways. You can download it to your uh, files or you can just hit view. And once you hit view, you hold that thing down, bam, and add it to your photos. Once you add it to your photos, you have it in your photos. You go to your photo log, bam, there it is. You have a transparent background. And that, my friends, is how you do it. If you found any value in this video, this is what I need you to do. I need you to comment below, hit the thumbs up. Also hit the subscribe button. Do me a great favor. I need you to hit share, copy, and send it to all of your friends because I want them to stop posting flyers like this. Start posting flyers like that. I see you next time, family. You guys are so amazing. Our mission here is to empower the world to never give up one video at a time. Grace and peace. <laughs>